Hi, everybody. I'm Ron Cantor, and this is Out of Zion on God TV. Something I'm asked quite a bit is why should believers pray for Israel? Well, today I've got five reasons. Number one, in Isaiah 62, God says, Give me no rest until I make Jerusalem a praise in all the earth. And presently, Jerusalem is not a praise in all the earth. So we've got some work to do in prayer. Number two, the Bible says that when Yeshua comes back, that he will judge the nations that survive based on how they treated the least of his brothers. Now, I believe, just to be clear, that we should always love the poor, minister to widows and orphans. But scholars believe that when Yeshua refers to the least of his brothers, he's talking about natural Israel. Number three, Jewish and non-Jewish believers are part of the same olive tree. And Paul says that together we make up the one new man, the household of God. Number four, God says, I will bless those who bless Israel and I will curse those who curse Israel. Great Britain was once the most powerful nation on earth and they were also the best friend of the Jewish people. However, in the 20s and then more in the 30s, they turned viciously against the Jewish people and today they're only a shell of their former self. Furthermore, God says, he who touches Israel touches the apple of my eye. Number five, Yeshua is not coming back until the Jewish people recognize him and welcome him. In Matthew 23, Yeshua says, you will not see me again speaking to the Orthodox Jews of Jerusalem until you say, Baruch haba b'shem Adonai. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. Now in Israel, Baruch haba, it's a greeting, a welcome. If you land in Ben Gurion Airport, you will see in English, welcome to Israel, and in Hebrew, Baruchim habaim l'Israel. And that's the first five reasons of why believers should pray for Israel. We've got five more coming very soon. Now make sure you never miss an episode by going to God.tv and you can find me at roncantor.com. Shalom from the shores of the Mediterranean Sea. Please follow Ron on Twitter and Facebook at Ron S. Cantor to find out more about Ron and his ministry. For more information on God TV and the Out of Zion programs, or to view these programs again, go to god.tv forward slash Zion.